out and about in 2018 week 32 start on a fairly humid Tuesday morning for a too bad Tuesday the reason that there was no Monday this week is like changing work schedule means that for the foreseeable future it's going to be a Tuesday and Wednesday in the office a Thursday work from home basic we'll see what happens on that two part Tuesday well a few options for this week we're going with the uh, Schema home against Warrington Town at JMO first Tuesday the one towards the opposite of the Riverside is meeting but Schema home comes first with the outside option a few weeks ago being the Pool Torino but with clashing with two other things obviously Schema is the easiest and the cheapest so it's off to AI for the first day of the week in terms of sport in addition to tonight's game the Wigan Rugby returns on Friday home to Gas over the 8th like playing somewhere on Saturday but yet again Schema comes first so that one is a way to hard United well it feels a while since we've done this Bearing in mind it was only Thursday, but you know, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, it's AI. What a very cool morning, you know. It, well, that's the opening day of the working week completed. But as most Tuesdays, two part Tuesday. So it's from the Whittle into Liverpool, and to Old Skem for JMO. Skem against Warrington later on. So two part Tuesday continues here at JMO. As we welcome Warrington Town, 192nd overall game, 178 for Skemp. Third against Warrington, one loss, one draw, one game draw streak. 55th win overall. Well, we got the 50th home win on Saturday. 115th home game in Skem itself. 31st game in 2018. Sixth in the 18 19 season. 20th friendly overall. And it may only be August, but it's the 71st spot in attendance in 2018. Two years ago it was 92, that'll probably be caught. Last year's 107, that might take some beating though. So, it's Game United, Wellington Town, it's about an clock kick off. So, half time here, JMO Sports Park, Game United 2, Wellington Town 4. It's only half time, let's go get a lot more next time. So, full time, Game United 2, Wellington Town 4. No disappointment against the side. A division above and very strong tonight. We move on back to AI in the morning. Well, after a clear game of two halves last night, we saw Warrington win 4 2. All six goals coming in the first half, goal in the second half. Wednesday morning, nice and cool. Off to AI for the last time this week, obviously, the new work schedule. Tuesday and Wednesday in the office, Thursday for this week, we'll be at home. So we will be working tomorrow, but obviously, we'll be not needing to travel. And then, as week goes, Wigan Friday night, then skim away on Saturday. Well, nice and cool, out over on the middle. We're off to AI with the Wednesday shift. So, Thursday morning, what was originally planned to be a work at home today, we're in the pool for AI. So it's three days working, there's something special today. Well, at the start of the week, today would have been a bit of a lion, and then working off home. But after change yesterday, who uh, met a New Zealand golf pro, love the accent like. We've been asked to come into the office for today, which, you know, notice would have meant the weekly ticket would have benefited, but it's all good. Another day in work at AI, and that completes, I think, week eight. Well, that's it, Thursday afternoon, end of the working week, and for now, anyway, end of working in the Whittle for a bit because of a bit of a restructure basically the company's website's a little messed up so we're dropping down to casual work for now which is minimum of 10 hours a week three days 10 pound an hour so not much difference money wise except we don't have to travel here and while it's being sorted that's what we'll be doing along with the scam stuff obviously so we're still employed it's not an employment that was the worry and then eventually once everything's sorted maybe coming back down this way full time if not then we'll stay casual or move on to something else but as far as AI and the widow's concerned it's a bit of a break for now sporting weekend begins tomorrow we're going against Castleford I know as always happens on a Thursday before a Wigan game 
and then happier to come away to hide on Sunday. So out and about in 2018 continues with the sporting weekend. Beginning, we had Warrington Town to come on Tuesday, but this is the weekend. Wigan against Castlewood, Super 8 round 1, 3 1 3 overall, 2 9 5 for Wigan, 300 will come this year. 19th against Castlewood, 9 wins, 9 losses, someone's got to give, 1 game losing streak. Each has 12 for DW, which means 13th home game against Castlewood equals the record by Huddersfield early in the season. That won't be troubled, but St. Towns, I think, are close. 41st Rugby League in 2018, 21st Super League 8 overall, I've only ever missed one, that was last year's against Wakefield away, 90, 195 home overall, 72nd attendance in 2018, 73, welcome to London. So half time here in Wigan, Wigan 20, that's a win now, all good so far. So full time here at DW Stadium, Wigan 24, Castlewood 22. Certainly made it hard for themselves Wigan, although a few Wigan fans will probably be more relieved the fact that St. Helens lost. As far as the week itself is concerned, one weekend continues tomorrow with an away trip. Yes, some may say Wigan are having a double ender at Arnold, but football comes first these days. We're after Hard United, Eskem United, Matt Oban, for the race Stanley Shield. Let's hope it's a good end to the weekend. Well, it's a win here and that's what counts. So, out and about in 2018 concludes here at Ewan Field, home of Hard United as we face them for the race down the shield. As far as the statistics are concerned this afternoon, 193rd for overall, 179th for Skem itself. Fifth against Hard United, which equals the record quite a few teams have, but they've not been able to go to that sixth. One win, one loss, two draws. And it's a one game draw streak, because we came here a few months ago and drew nil nil. I didn't lose a single league game at home, so that was pretty decent. Second away against Hyde, as previously mentioned. 55th win is a possibility. 90th loss is also a possibility. Fifth away win? Well, in the 50th away game, it'd be a bit ideal, wouldn't it? 32nd game in 2018, football wise. Sixth in the 18 19 season. And 73rd attendance in 2018 overall. Hyde United and Scammers United. That should be a 3 o'clock kickoff. Half time here at Ewan Fields. Hyde United nil. It's going to be nice and though. All good. So, full time at Ewan Fields and sadly, disappointing result for United. Hard United 2, Skimmers United 0. Two second half goals. The one in the last minute we really didn't deserve to concede that one. Unlucky, but sadly, that's pre season at an end. And I'm still waiting the fifth away win. Is it ever going to come? That's a week completed.